Welcome to our English lesson. Today, we will practice Easy Speak English together about my home to improve your listening and speaking skills. We will also learn some interesting new vocabulary. Pay attention and listen carefully. Our story today is My New Cozy Home. Hi everyone, my name is Sophia. I'm so excited to share the story of my new house. Moving to a new place is a big change, but it has been a wonderful experience. And here is my new cozy house. A few weeks ago, I found a cozy little house that felt just right for me. It's not too big, but it's perfect for what I need. The first time I walked in, I felt a sense of warmth and comfort. The living room is my favorite part. It has a comfy sofa and a big window that lets in lots of natural light. I spend evenings there, reading books or just enjoying the view outside. It's the place where I can relax after a long working day. Or I can invite my parents and my friends to my home and we can play together, talking and watching TV in this large living room. In the kitchen, I've been trying out some simple recipes. Cooking in my new kitchen is a joy. The smell of homemade meals fills the air, making the whole house feel inviting. I even hosted a small dinner with friends to share the joy of my new home. Decorating the house has been a fun project. I added a few colorful cushions to the sofa and hung some artwork on the walls. It's amazing how a few little touches can make a space feel like your own. My bedroom is a peaceful retreat. I chose soft colors for the walls and added some fairy lights for a cozy touch. Every night, I crawl into bed with a smile, grateful for my new cozy haven. One weekend, I decided to work on the garden. It's a small space, but I planted some flowers and herbs. Now, when I sit outside with a cup of tea, I can enjoy the fresh air and the beauty of my little garden. Adjusting to a new neighborhood has been interesting. I've met friendly neighbors who welcomed me with smiles. We often chat over the fence or meet up for a cup of coffee. It's nice to feel a sense of community. One day, I invited my family over for a housewarming party. We laughed, shared stories, and made new memories together. It was the perfect way to celebrate my new beginning. Overall, my new house has become more than just a place to live. It's a haven of comfort, joy, and new beginnings. I'm looking forward to creating many more happy memories in this special space. So, that is my cozy home. I love my house very much. How about your home? I love to hear about your place soon. So, before we practice speaking, let's learn some new interesting words to improve your English that you can use to tell your own stories. Cozy. Comfortable and warm. The living room with a comfy sofa feels cozy. Inviting. Welcoming and appealing. Homemade meals make the house feel inviting. Host. To entertain guests or organize an event. I hosted a small dinner for friends. Retreat. A quiet and private place for relaxation. My bedroom is a peaceful retreat. Haven. A safe and comfortable place. My new house has become a haven for me. Adjust. To get used to or become familiar with. I'm adjusting to my new neighborhood. Community. A group of people living in the same area. I feel a sense of community with my neighbors. Garden. An area with plants and flowers. I planted flowers in my small garden. Housewarming. A party to celebrate moving into a new home. We had a housewarming party with family. Beginning. The start of something new. The housewarming party marked a new beginning. Good job! Now is time for you to practice speaking. Let repeat after Sophia. Hi everyone, my name is Sophia. Hi everyone, my name is Sophia. I'm so excited to share the story of my new house. I'm so excited to share the story of my new house. Moving to a new place is a big change. Moving to a new place is a big change. But it has been a wonderful experience.
but it has been a wonderful experience. And here is my new cozy house. And here is my new cozy house. A few weeks ago, I found a cozy little house. A few weeks ago, I found a cozy little house. That felt just right for me. That felt just right for me. It's not too big, but it's perfect for what I need. It's not too big, but it's perfect for what I need. The first time I walked in. The first time I walked in. I felt a sense of warmth and comfort. I felt a sense of warmth and comfort. The living room is my favorite part. The living room is my favorite part. It has a comfy sofa and a big window. It has a comfy sofa and a big window. That lets in lots of natural light. That lets in lots of natural light. I spend evenings there, reading books. I spend evenings there, reading books. Or just enjoying the view outside. Or just enjoying the view outside. Or I can invite my parents and my friends. Or I can invite my parents and my friends. To my home and we can play together. To my home and we can play together. Talking and watching TV in this large living room. Talking and watching TV in this large living room. In the kitchen, I've been trying out some simple recipes. In the kitchen, I've been trying out some simple recipes. Cooking in my new kitchen is a joy. Cooking in my new kitchen is a joy. The smell of homemade meals fills the air. The smell of homemade meals fills the air. Making the whole house feel inviting. Making the whole house feel inviting. I even hosted a small dinner with friends. I even hosted a small dinner with friends. To share the joy of my new home. To share the joy of my new home. Decorating the house has been a fun project. Decorating the house has been a fun project. I added a few colorful cushions to the sofa. I added a few colorful cushions to the sofa and hung some artwork on the walls. And hung some artwork on the walls. It's amazing how a few little touches. It's amazing how a few little touches can make a space feel like your own. Can make a space feel like your own. My bedroom is a peaceful retreat. My bedroom is a peaceful retreat. I chose soft colors for the walls. I chose soft colors for the walls. And added some fairy lights for a cozy touch. And added some fairy lights for a cozy touch. Every night, I crawl into bed with a smile. Every night, I crawl into bed with a smile. Grateful for my new cozy haven. Grateful for my new cozy haven. One weekend, I decided to work on the garden. One weekend, I decided to work on the garden. It's a small space, but I planted some flowers and herbs. It's a small space, but I planted some flowers and herbs. Now, when I sit outside with a cup of tea. Now, when I sit outside with a cup of tea. I can enjoy the fresh air and the beauty of my little garden. I can enjoy the fresh air and the beauty of my little garden. Adjusting to a new neighborhood has been interesting. Adjusting to a new neighborhood has been interesting. I've met friendly neighbors who welcomed me with smiles. I've met friendly neighbors who welcomed me with smiles. We often chat over the fence or meet up for a cup of coffee. We often chat over the fence or meet up for a cup of coffee. It's nice to feel a sense of community. It's nice to feel a sense of community. One day, I invited my family over for a housewarming party. One day, I invited my family over for a housewarming party. We laughed, shared stories, and made new memories together. We laughed, shared stories, and made new memories together.
It was the perfect way to celebrate my new beginning. It was the perfect way to celebrate my new beginning. Overall, my new house has become more than just a place to live. Overall, my new house has become more than just a place to live. It's a haven of comfort, joy, and new beginnings. It's a haven of comfort, joy, and new beginnings. I'm looking forward to creating many more. I'm looking forward to creating many more. Happy memories in this special space. Happy memories in this special space. So, that is my cozy home. So, that is my cozy home. I love my house very much. I love my house very much. How about your home? I love to hear about your place soon. How about your home? I love to hear about your place soon. That's right. Now let's listen carefully to the story again and answer some questions. Hi everyone, my name is Sophia. I'm so excited to share the story of my new house. Moving to a new place is a big change, but it has been a wonderful experience. And here is my new cozy house. A few weeks ago, I found a cozy little house that felt just right for me. It's not too big, but it's perfect for what I need. The first time I walked in, I felt a sense of warmth and comfort. The living room is my favorite part. It has a comfy sofa and a big window that lets in lots of natural light. I spend evenings there, reading books or just enjoying the view outside. It's the place where I can relax after a long working day. Or I can invite my parents and my friends to my home and we can play together, talking and watching TV in this large living room. In the kitchen, I've been trying out some simple recipes. Cooking in my new kitchen is a joy. The smell of homemade meals fills the air, making the whole house feel inviting. I even hosted a small dinner with friends to share the joy of my new home. Decorating the house has been a fun project. I added a few colorful cushions to the sofa and hung some artwork on the walls. It's amazing how a few little touches can make a space feel like your own. My bedroom is a peaceful retreat. I chose soft colors for the walls and added some fairy lights for a cozy touch. Every night, I crawl into bed with a smile, grateful for my new cozy haven. One weekend, I decided to work on the garden. It's a small space, but I planted some flowers and herbs. Now, when I sit outside with a cup of tea, I can enjoy the fresh air and the beauty of my little garden. Adjusting to a new neighborhood has been interesting. I've met friendly neighbors who welcomed me with smiles. We often chat over the fence or meet up for a cup of coffee. It's nice to feel a sense of community. One day, I invited my family over for a housewarming party. We laughed, shared stories, and made new memories together. It was the perfect way to celebrate my new beginning. Overall, my new house has become more than just a place to live. It's a haven of comfort, joy, and new beginnings. I'm looking forward to creating many more happy memories in this special space. So, that is my cozy home. I love my house very much. How about your home? I love to hear about your place soon. Now, answer following questions. My Cozy Home Quiz 1. What is Sophia's favorite part of the house? That's right, B is correct. In the morning, Sophia loves her living room. She often relaxes after a hard working day here. 2. What did the person add to the sofa to make the space feel personalized? Awesome, D. Sophia added a few colorful cushions to the sofa and hung some artwork on the walls. 3. What does Sophia often do on her weekend? Got it. Right, B is correct. Sophia often spends her weekends planting flowers and herbs in her garden. 4. How does Sophia describe adjusting to the new neighborhood? Correct. B is the answer. She likes her neighborhood. 5. What does Sophia do to celebrate the new beginning in the house? Time up now. The answer is A. 
She celebrates her new house with a party with her friends and closely. That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed speaking about my cozy home. The more you practice, the more comfortable you will become speaking English. With regular practice, you will see improvement in your English listening and speaking skills. So don't wait, start practicing today. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss the next lesson. Thanks for watching.